Hey guys, today we're going to be testing the difference between the leading attribute, the marching attribute, and the attacking attribute in the general leadership skills. So to show you what I'm talking about, you can see with Roland's base skill says, increases amount of troop attack when general is leading the army to attack. And then his first red star says, marching mounted troop attack 15%. These boots here say marching mounted troop attack. We're interested in those two clauses and then this third one. Increases mounted troop attack by 25% when general is leading the army. So these are the three clauses in today's video. We're not going to talk about Freya and the defending outside main city clause. I'm going to do a video on that one soon, testing that. This is just these three clauses. And these are the results that I found during my testing. So, did a bat battlefield today, and I set a uh, march in a building with no general, one with Lee Nimosa, and one with Roland, to compare. This is the total buffs for no general, 269% attack for mounted. Lee Nimosa got it up to 431, and then Roland got it up to 549. Now, these are all the buffs that they're going to give you from all their things. We got their attributes that are going to give them some buffs their base skill, the skill with the claws, which is Roland's skill march, the gear, which I don't have any gear on Lena Mosa, only on Roland, so 95% gear for uh, Roland, and then the boots that I showed you that have the marching claws, 10% there, 6% for a specialty that is just general mounted attack, and then 4% for specifically marching mounted troop attack. And these are the totals for that numbers to help my math be a little bit better. Now, if we add all these numbers up to this number, we get the expected value, 431%. That's going to show us that, yes, all of these buffs are active. All of these buffs are active for Roland 2, including the marching and the attacking one, even though he was defending the building. So we can see from this that, yes, the marching and the attacking buffs do work in Battlefield. As an error in my previous videos, I've always said that the leading generals work in battlefield, which I mean, they do work, but so do the attacking ones, so apologies for that. Turns out I'm wrong. I also tested attacks on the Alliance City, running the same numbers, adding all these to the base, and yeah, all the buffs are active for the Alliance City as well for Roland, so... Even if you're defending your Alliance City, you can still have an attacking general and get full use of your buffs. Same is to be said for farms and tiles. These numbers all add up, and they check out all these buffs are active. I really wanted to test the reinforcing one, where I would reinforce an Alliance member and see if the buffs are active in there. However, it does not show me my buffs for those battle reports. It only shows the city owner's buffs, so... I don't have a way to test that. If you know a way around that, you can help me figure that out. I'd appreciate you leaving a comment below. But for now, that's just undecided. The only situation I could find where the attacking and the marching didn't work was when I put them on the wall. We can see here that Roland only at 698, which if you add up all these numbers, this is exactly the amount we would expect if the marching and the leading were not active. So. The only use situation that a leading general has or an attacking one that I've been able to find is defending on the wall, which really isn't that much of a use situation. Now, let's flip back to the reinforcing aspect real quick. With reinforcing, my theory is I think that it's going to only be applicable to the leading general. And my reason for that is because Freya has the defending outside main city clause and it wouldn't make sense to include that if it also if the attacking general also worked for reinforcing it seems like that general is geared towards reinforcing so i expect to see that only the leading clause will work in that and not the attacking general will work for that however with the alliance city i was expecting the leading generals not to work so maybe Maybe it's going to play by these rules, or maybe it's going to play by the defending rules. So I don't really know if you can help me figure out that. I'd appreciate it.
Alright, that's all I got for today. If y'all found this video useful, maybe consider leaving me a like and maybe a subscribe, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.